The following podcast has been rated listener MA. It contains strong language, violence, adult situations, nudity. Listener discretion is advised. Uh, would you rather give up cheese or blowjobs for the rest of your life? <laughs> blowjobs all day. I, I'm the same. I'm fucking Yeah, same. they hurt my jaw. Blank. Rejected name for condoms. Gosh, I don't know. Cock koozies, jizz mittens, ham holsters, kidnappers. Yeah, try it now! <laughs> <laughs> try it, try it now! What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of the Laughing on the Sidelines podcast. I am your host. My name is Scotty German, a.k.a. Scooter McFuckstick. And alongside me, I have two very funny people, not quite stand-up comedians, but they're very funny people nonetheless. First, we have the funniest homosexual that we all know and love very much, none other than Mr. JP. Welcome. God, that dude is a stud. He is kind of, you He's so cool. He's special. Yeah, he is. He is special. Uh, but also, we have the funniest member of my family and definitely the favorite, none other than definitely. Mr. Fred yeah. slash Clayton. It's probably not hard to be the favorite in this <laughs> family. I'm not just not saying. It's a short step. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like you have really not, you're running out of options at this point. It's like he's kind of the favorite by default. I right. Mean, I, I just got my participation trophy last. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The That's best right. For last. There you go. They gave it to him with a wink like, here you go. Yeah, here you yeah. go. <laughs> Don't show Scott. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit. But, yes, yeah, so uh, Derek is doing baseball this week. Uh, Thank so, God. Right? Oh, man, I, I feel I, refreshed. I know. I'm happy this <laughs> I episode. I feel good about I mean, I, really, just good about life. Yeah. And Derek's not here to shit all over it. So <laughs> I really kind of like that. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to miss the cynical kind of, like, jabs at <laughs> yeah. me from time to time. But, Eh. Don't worry, I'll fill in. Uh, Thanks, man. I can sure try. Yeah. I was gonna say, my, yeah, I, I my think brother will be able to do that, <laughs> probably, uh, with some in- inside jokes attached to it. But uh, we do have a great episode as usual. I actually have a lot more things that are current events, not sports related, since both of you. I mean, you guys are kind of sports guys, but not really. So I, I, I went with Twitter. I like water sports. I, I figured you probably do, uh, but that's. We can talk about that. I don't think so. I think. Uh, I think, you know, we could not want to get okay. canceled. So. All right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, but no. I, I mean, if we get canceled, we won't have to show up next week. <laughs> There's we're, that. We're getting dangerously close. <laughs> uh, but anyways, no, we got some Twitter news that I'm excited to go over, and we're going to have a lot of fun with that. Um, we've got overrated or underrated, or I'm very excited for a new segment, and it is called, Yeah, I'm That Guy, yeah, or I like Fuck that. that Guy. Fuck that guy. I really like this. Uh, and then also we have uh, questions and preguntas, as usual a draft and as always we get to have a shitty situation to wrap up the show but before we do that i want to know what happened to you guys over the week we call it our week week recap and we're going to start off with jp What's really there? really easy this week I again smoked pot, i smoked pot bold. played some video games oh. i bowled okay i bowled really good and then really shitty so yeah we'll talk about it i don't I, know why you're forcing my hands but <laughs> Real I, cool, man. Like, there has to be something that you do. I mean, like, what video games did you play? Tetris. Uh, Zelda. I played the fifth. Oh. 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 Well, they were all sports games. I don't play anything else. Really? Mm-hmm. Hmm. I thought you, you would were... think that. You're right. You'd think I was just a big freaking, like, yeah. nerd, but no. What's the sport game that you're on right now? Is it of... Wii Bowling? Yeah. That, no. I mean, that's a good point. No, it's not Wii Bowling. Uh, <laughs> Like uh, PGA Tour 2023. Are you fucking kidding me? You play uh, golfing yeah. oh, as yeah. much shit as oh, yeah. you I give me. I fucking dig the golf, baby. <laughs> oh, what a I got to go buy a new we Xbox get that one. Uh, because they just came out with a new one, uh, the Masters. Yeah. But you can only get it on the Series S. Oh. So I've got to go buy a new Xbox, which uh-huh. is like 500 bucks, but that's okay. But you paid off your car, so you... Yeah, so now I'll be able to afford it. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's just smart. That you is know what? Smart. You pay off your car. Don't spend... Don't fucking save money for something important. Go buy a new Xbox. I'm just yeah. all positive today, man. Yeah, I don't know cool, man. what it is, but I'm it's just... Yeah. Yeah. There's like, it's, it's like, like there's, there's a, a black a, cloud in this. Like there's a void that's... <laughs> yeah, no, here. no joke. <laughs> Uh, but oh shit! Uh, but um, other than I mean, I thought you were really excited for Zelda too, weren't you? Mm. No, it wasn't you. No. Oh no, you're right. Not that since the a- first one. 
Oh, the first one was the bomb. Yeah, man. That yeah, was, was bomb.com. Now it's just, yeah. Okay. All it's right. too much. We'll find. Did you eat anywhere spectacular? I mean, let's dive into no, your unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> neither. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, neither. I really didn't do shit this week. It was a real busy week at work with Mother's Day and stuff like that. Yeah. So. That's kind of what I was getting at. We yeah. all had we all I had the uh, really whole lot. child birthing day. Is that what we're going to call it now? Yeah. Is that OK? Um, how was yours? Good. How's your mom? Good. Real good. Yeah. Yeah. Went over eight. OK. Hung out. Yeah. God, you're really fucking eating it today. You are. Oh, I know. I'm sorry. I, I wish if I had more for you, man. I just, I'm fucking giving you all I got, Captain. Okay, fine. I mean, yeah. Uh, I went and played freaking cards at a friend's on Friday night. Did you win? No. <laughs> Matter of fact, I had to hit the ATM again. So <laughs> that's fucking, that's not good. God damn it. And Derek wasn't there, though, so he didn't win any of my money. So really, it that was a victory. It was really a victory. Yeah, no kidding. As long as somebody else gets your money, just don't let Derek get your money. No, That's the God, whole no. goal. He's got enough fucking money. No shit. Wheel of Fortune money still. Oh, that guy's still rolling in he it. He says that he's out oh, of dude. it. He I don't think Pat Sajak has much more than what he's got. Absolutely. To be I think you. you're probably I mean, true. He's right there. Yeah. Sajak. Yeah, Derek. That's right. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Right there. Uh, well, it sucks because like our weekends kind of intertwined because my brother and me we went on a trip. Oh damn! Damn it! Yeah. Damn when you it. said that your weekends intertwined, I got fucking kind of. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I was yeah. like, wow. All no, right. I'm not no the favorite. Not, I, I got for a, nothing. I, I got a lot. So cool. I mean, you can tell your side of the. Scotty weekend. always has a lot to he, say, uh, he, but I he don't. never does shit. No, it's he not. Does. But I don't. he likes to talk about like every fucking thing he does. Uh, I, well, that's, I gotta, that's all he's got. I, I got to yeah. fill time, dickhead. <laughs> no. So so that's what I'm trying to do. Well, unfortunately, when you show up with smoked pot, bold, and hung out with my mom that's what i got we've been doing this for five minutes now so i feel like i've done my <laughs> part and carrying my okay. weight whether okay. i did anything last last week or not makes no fucking difference yeah okay fair enough all right fred you tell your side oh shit man it's been busy since i've been on no uh, shit in a few weeks uh hell we've golfed what three four times together us as couples yeah the the women are getting better than we are so yeah I'm gonna, pretty I'm gonna much qu quit taking them well well better than you uh, excuse me? Yeah, better than you. How many balls did you lose last weekend? Hey, shut the fuck there up. There you I, go. That was a difficult there course. There you go. It was a difficult so. course. <laughs> <laughs> it was in the backyard. <laughs> yeah. That $1,200 $1, didn't, that $1,200 driver didn't do shit for no, me this weekend. No, uh -oh. not this weekend, no. No good. No, so like Scotty said, we went back home to our hometown. Yep. Um, we got where, so much. where in Alabama was this? Uh, what's it? What's, it's at the corner of Fuck Your Cousin. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right in the middle of bum fucking you got a purdy mouth. That's yeah, where we were. Good deal. No, uh, no, Western Kansas is yes, where sir. we're both from. Yes, sir. So Garden City, Kansas. If you, oh, if you, Garden if you City? You're yeah. from Garden City? Yeah, yeah. born. Born, not raised. All right, see you later. <laughs> see you. Bye. <laughs> hey, can we call Derek real quick? No, yeah, let's get Derek back in here. Surely he can make it. No, I'll bring the rest That's of the podcast cool. down. Right on. I didn't know that. Yeah, both of us. Yep. Oh, man. So, yeah. So. Well, you've done well for yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Considering you came from Garden yeah. City. Moved no 200 kidding. miles away. Yeah. yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck. I got some feedback Something in the mic. I think, in. check your phones. Yep, it's JP's. Oh, yeah, that was yeah. So anyway, what uh, uh, what do you remember about uh, a couple of things? I left a lot of this stuff out, but because it was bigger than anything, it was actually your birthday. Correct. Yes. Correct. My birthday was Friday, so now I'm uh, nice. almost old as fuck. Yeah, and almost. I'm, uh, I quit counting in two years. Mm -hmm. uh, Is that when yeah. you turn 30? Uh, yeah. 40. <laughs> oh, in two years 40, you're going to be 40? Yeah. Fuck. Yeah, no so grays or nothing, nothing hardly. Man. That's pretty fucking Hell impressive, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah, I'm younger than he is. What a dick. Uh, I've got so? grays up here yeah. all over the place. It's bullshit. Be, that's I've what got you get for being a favorite, man. Yeah. Yeah, so we did that. My niece, our niece, sorry, graduated college. High school, damn, I'm all fucked up. <laughs> uh, a year early, yeah. So that oh, was a big cool. accomplishment. So um, I didn't want to overshadow her victory with my birthday. I, Correct. I, I get those a lot. <laughs> um, Being uh, the favorite, you <laughs> overpower everybody. Yeah, exactly. That's what happens. Uh, and then Mother's Day, and me and a good buddy from back home, we always celebrate our birthdays together with a crawfish boil. Yeah, dude. So we had that this weekend, and shit, this is our fifth year. Yeah, and. We're gonna have to buy a bigger crawfish pot. No shit. We, we already have a big one. It's like a thirty gallon, and it was twenty five people there, twelve kids. Yep. There was a shitload of kids. Yep. Which oh, yeah. obviously makes me very uncomfortable because I don't like kids. Yep. Well, 
Yeah. yeah. Until so. Two years ago, there were no kids. I know. Wow. <laughs> there were, there were yeah. one kid. <laughs> that, yeah. That was yeah. Be, like the maximum age of these kids was like two. Oh, yeah. So they were all they were over everywhere. the place. Yeah. But they were awesome. They, yeah. they were real good this weekend. Yeah, they were. Uh, and Mother's Day, you know, and mm. we had all kinds of family from out of town and just had a great time. Yeah. Great time. We able to take off Friday with the family. Yeah. Uh, five of us went out golfing. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, at our hometown course, yeah, that, that was you know, the big where, thing where we where we learned to play. Southwind and, Country Southwind Country Club in Garden City, Kansas, is where we went, and I gotta say, bro, I was fucking impressed. It's a gorgeous course. It's not only gorgeous; it was gorgeous back then. But I was kind of thinking that you know maybe things just kind of decay over time. Mm-hmm. Holy shit! Well, uh, you know, we used to be members out there. Uh, yeah, my fiance and I and. Um, it's under new ownership, and they've put a lot of money back into it. Right, as you could tell. Oh, you know, yeah, the, the driving range and the uh, what do they call those? The, the clubhouse and yep. the bar, the restaurant, everything, yeah. everything looked yeah. fucking gorgeous. Uh, but yeah, it was freaking nice. The course conditions, especially for being. I mean, I know it's like the beginning of the summer, but we complain all the time, especially in Kansas, especially how, how dry it's been over mm-hmm. the last couple of weeks and stuff up until like fucking yesterday. But um, it was everywhere you would go, the fairway would just be dirt. It'd be like hitting off a of fucking dirt. And so it wasn't that fun, but it was fucking lush, green, yep. rough was thick. It was awesome. Oh, yeah. They take care of it. Yeah. So um, you had the crawfish. The other thing I was going to say about the crawfish was the, the pot that you guys had. You guys bought 25 pounds of crawfish. Correct. Plus crab legs. Plus probably 20 pounds of crab yeah, legs. Yeah. And uh, sausage, mussels. Oh, fuck. Uh, I, I, I've had another crawfish boil before. And I got to say, I am not the biggest crawfish fan. That's fine. I, I still had, uh, I, I partook. Uh, I was mashing on, on crab legs oh, for the majority yeah. part of it, right? And uh, those were delicious. <laughs> Uh, but I've also been to an actual Cajun Louisiana people kind of a, a crawfish boil mm-hmm. here in town, and don't tell them, but that was better. Boom! Yeah, uh, that was fucking. Oh no, I know you know no. no. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, my yeah. no, Buscati. Yeah, C- Cajuns were uh, not as good as this. Oh man, there you go. So, very oh, nice. That's very, that. Man, that's yeah. fucking high praise. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and so we did go golfing, which was awesome, but there's one thing that you need to, especially for people like me, that you need to remember when you go out and it's overcast and that is put on fucking sunscreen. Yeah. No yeah. Good. I got burnt on the top of my yeah. arms and it's kind of gone away right now. I've aloe vera the shit out of my arms, but uh, yeah, I you, lobstered. Yeah. You were as red as your hat. Mm-hmm. You, your arms. Were oh, right. yeah. I, I have to be loose. really careful. Cause whenever I play, I play with my dick hanging out. That's correct. So. It can see the sun now. Oh like, yeah. Oh, I figured your belly. Well, it out. makes it more sensitive, no. right? I'm, I'm, I mean, there's like a level of pleasure right. and pain that right. you kind of have to That's, go with. I just do like a 50-50 deal. <laughs> oh, do you? Yeah. Okay, so shaft is white as hell, but the tip is Everything, red. Yeah. Oh, got it. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's like, like a, a candy photo, cane of cock. Photo, yeah, photograph's better that way. <laughs> okay. It's like a candy cane of cock is what it is right merry christmas <laughs> <laughs> got the, got the curve and all huh? yeah, yeah that's right uh so yeah we did that um got uh got mother's day out of the way that was cool um i got to go to uh we came back and i hung out with my mom so i got to spend mother's day with her that was uh that was great uh, but on the way back uh here in kansas it was raining like motherfucker uh all day uh, sunday and so our whole trip home was riding through the rain. It was really shitty. But uh, the best part was we were ended up going over to my mom's house. And on the way, on the highway, when it was downpouring rain, is a lone motherfucker on a motorcycle driving <laughs> through that shit. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like yep. dog, nice. what are you doing? And yep. it's not like it was a secret that, oh, maybe, maybe. we'll get it's some rain. No. All day. All they, fucking yeah. day. Yep. This dude is in chaps and all kinds of shit with like, a, like the face covering and everything yeah. like that on so i give that dude mad props i i wanted to go past him just in case he laid that motherfucker yeah. over oh yeah didn't uh didn't want to be yep. behind that um trying I've been to that think. guy yeah oh yeah yeah I took my harley up to kansas city years ago 
got stuck Ooh. in a rainstorm in like Emporia or some shit. And yeah. The rain just hurts. Oh, know, sure. Go, even going 40. I'm sure, yeah. So you, I, doesn't, I, you don't have to be yeah, going very fast. I was under a gas station for like an hour just sitting there. I believe it. And the other thing is he didn't, he didn't even have a helmet on. He had like sunglasses yep. sunglasses and nothing. So he yep. was getting hit with every single little yep. bit of it. Same. And he, and he also, you know what he didn't have? He also didn't have a windscreen. Yep. So Same. he was just getting hit hardly yeah, with right fucking handlebars. Just yeah. getting They're taking like babies, every bit. dude. Oh, yeah. Um, and the other thing. The other thing, whenever we have rain, one of my dogs has severe anxiety when it comes to storms or fireworks. It sucks when it when it's going to be a thunderstorm or a loud clap or, or, or anything. Or <laughs> Boom! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no wuss. shit. He is a wuss. So, uh, and my parents are watching him. My my mom was watching him, and uh, she has instructions whenever we know it's going to rain to make sure that you give him some trazodone, which is basically doggy Prozac. And we get over there, and it's storming kind of you can hear thunder in the background that dog is laying on a bed awake but his eyes were <laughs> fucking shut oh yeah dude was so high God. as oh. giraffe pussy <laughs> i mean dude was having he's a feeling good, good time, baby. he's man. feeling good and i was like good god good girl, like mom. that's yeah. the perfect dog for me <laughs> oh yeah just give him trazodone daily it's it's fucking magical uh, so yeah, it, it was uh, it was a really good time. I got to obviously hang out with family. That was that's always fun, especially when I can involve my brother and stuff. We have a fucking great time. Great time. Uh, didn't play very well, but uh, it got the golf thing. But God, it was great our, to play. Our front nine was good. Front nine was good. I did back nine. The wind came up and yeah, it was really with it was a little windy. Um, but yeah, it was still a lot of fun. I had an absolute blast. And so yeah, anything else you guys wanted to talk about, especially over this last weekend? You guys are fucking worthless. At least Derek can pull something out of his... No, I'm just kidding. I'd much rather have you two here. <laughs> I was like, man, I'll leave. Uh, no, you uh, don't. Guys, we can cut this real no. short. This will be a real, honestly, real quick episode. Uh, honestly, with the shit that I have coming up, it's going to be a while. So we may have a little bit longer episode as usual. But before we get to that, uh, I want to give a shout out as we try to do every single time and uh, talk about battlecorncarepackages.com. But instead of me doing it, I wanted to introduce you guys, introduce you guys to Curtis with battlecorncarepackages.com. Hi, everybody. My name is Curtis, and my family and I run Battlecorn Care Packages, a nonprofit organization that sends care packages to children battling cancer. In 2021, we began this organization when our daughter, JC, was diagnosed with a rare form of brain cancer. Today, we run it in her honor. In addition to that, we also host events throughout the year to raise money and awareness for pediatric cancer research. On August 26th in Appleton, Wisconsin, we will be hosting our second annual Gold Time Masquerade, where we will be donating 100% of the proceeds to the Pediatric Brain Tumor Foundation with a goal of $25,000. All of the information, including donor, sponsorship, and ticket sales, can be found on our website at battlecorncarepackages.com. Thank you, and we hope to see you there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, do us a favor and go check out battlecorncarepackages.com. Curtis is an excellent person. We love what he's doing at his nonprofit organization. Uh, hope to, that he gets to his goal, $25,000. Anybody that you know that could help spread the word to them, uh, we would really like for him to hit his goal. Thank you very much, Curtis, and battlecorncarepackages.com. Okay, Twitter news, baby. Okay, we do have a little bit of sports to go over. Okay. Yeah. Because there's really one thing. I don't want to go over statistics in baseball and all this other shit because it's just, it's just baseball right now. But the Cardinals did sweep the Red Sox. So I have some positivity in my absolutely shitty team. But the NBA playoffs are obviously going on right now. And as of today, when we are recording this, uh, we know that the Lakers have moved on. And uh, I believe, who do they play? Then Is it the Nuggets? This Yeah, it's the Nuggets this time because uh, Miami plays the yes. Boston Celtics. Correct. So, um, come on, Nuggets. Yeah. Let's, let's do it, please. Yeah, of course. Would, would you eat those? Nuggets? Come on, Nuggets? Yeah. Uh, if you, if you it was would, mine. You would eat your own come on, Nuggets? Yeah. Have you ever played the game Limp Nugget? I don't know if I want to be here anymore. <laughs> I don't know. I'm also nugget. feeling a bit uncomfortable, which is weird for me. Absolutely I don't, I'm not used to that. Oh, uh, no. Uh, but no, I, I'm going to take the Derek stance on this political, uh, on this whole particular uh, you NBA think it's playoff. rigged? The, <laughs> you think it's rigged? The NBA is rigged. If God the, damn it. If the Lakers make it to the NBA finals against the Boston Celtics, his then it's bitch rigged. is rigged. I, I don't think, know. I think the uh, free throw, um, the free throws for the Lakers and the Golden State Warriors was like 68 to 126 
uh, for the whole series. So, yeah, it's fucking rigged. Quit calling fouls. Let them play, you bitches. Uh, but, yeah, that's the, only, uh, that's the only sports news I got. Okay. I did miss something several weeks ago. Several, several weeks well, then, ago. By God, let's go back and talk about it because <laughs> God forbid we just miss it. It needs to be <laughs> talked it has about. To be talked about. So we have another person that comes on this podcast whose name is Mike. Mike is also another stand-up comedian. He made a joke or a reference to something that I laughed at, but I didn't really understand at the moment because I never really saw the video. And then the videos just started coming through my Twitter like fucking waterfall. And it turns out, did you see the Dalai Lama got a kid to suck on his tongue? The- yeah, man. What? That's old news, fuck? bro. Wow. I, I, I miss that. I totally did. And and then Mike. You should have seen what he got me to suck on. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I feel at peace now. I'm glad I, I you am, do. I am one. I am I, one. I just, uh, I mean, you know, I, you would think that somebody around him would have been like, yo, Dolly Lama. Maybe Lund, not. Like, not. Not now. Cameras, no, motherfucker. He liked it, dude. Oh, yeah, he did. Somebody, he told the kid yeah. to do it. Like, yeah. what? Is that a specific kind of ritual that we just don't know about? I'm not Buddhist. So I have no idea. Maybe that's normal there. Yeah, I, don't I mean, know, man. is that a thing? Epstein Island? I've got no nah, idea. Check the records. I don't even think they there. were doing anything that no. crazy. No. <laughs> <laughs> there's a no tongue. Yeah, yeah. there's a no tongue yeah. sucking yeah. rule oh, on man. Epstein Island. Poor kid. I, I I hope nothing bad happened to you. Well, he fucking <laughs> he's blessed for all eternity now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's got Dalai Lama saliva in his oh, mouth. Oh man. Oh, that that's this is a seventy year old man. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, I, I wanted to refer to that just so everybody cleared up that joke. Well, thank God we brought that up. <laughs> that was I, worth I, it. Oh, that. man, thank God. Because people were hey. probably wondering, why didn't they talk about the Dalai Lama? Uh, hey, uh, my Twitter is fucked up right now. Oh, so man. It just whatever came down. Okay. Uh, anyways, I did see this. This is actually fairly new. Uh, somebody tried to sell their contacts uh, online, uh, and they tried to sell them as the contacts that saw Taylor Swift's new tour for ten thousand well, dollars. How close were they? I don't know. I have no I idea. Mean, but they didn't say that. They didn't specify that in the description. Out. It was just the simple fact that those contacts saw taylor swift wow yeah do you, you think they sold them i oh, hope yeah. so that's, that's a sad thing about <laughs> too. humans now that that's is fucking they're sad story. Thing. that dude that's brilliant yeah. <laughs> if, it goes, that is, if that works oh i have some things to sell <laughs> this is you no know, shit <laughs> see this is the point of where i'm wow. thinking people are so fucking stupid that somebody you know who bought them the guy Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift did? Yeah. yeah. She's that she dumb, wanted too. To know, yeah. She wanted to know what it, what it would look like through her fans' eyes. Yeah. Uh, I, totally. Yeah. Uh, I, I hope they did. I really, really hope that that guy sold them. And then I want that person to be blown up on social media so we can all call them a fucking dumbass. So that's... Uh, all right. So that's, that's something uh, to look forward to. Something to look forward Here to. Here in about three weeks when nobody <laughs> fucking cares about it anymore. We'll, we'll, tell, we we'll talk, talk about, about it. it. We'll again. talk about it again. That's what we do. Uh, next one. Vin Diesel confirms that Fast X is the first film in a new trilogy for Fast and Furious. Dude. The guy needs to give a fuck up. Dude. <laughs> that franchise should have hit a tree a long time ago. <laughs> it's like going it 70. Yeah, it's fucking right. dead. I know. Oh. Jesus. You can kill Paul Walker, but, but you, can't you can't kill you Fast can't and kill Furious. Kill the franchise, baby. Jesus Christ! My God. Why? I guess. I mean, as long as they're making money, why the fuck would you stop making them at this point? That's kind of where I was going. It was just like, I mean, I guess if they keep on making money, I mean, what else are you gonna yeah, do? Yeah, but who the fuck is watching it to make that, that much money? Derek. <laughs> yeah, People Derek. like Derek. People like Derek. 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 But that's when we kind of tie this to the selling your contacts that saw Taylor Swift's fucking concert. Correct. It's those people that would buy. The I would contacts. pay. I would I would buy the contacts before I watch another <laughs> fucking Fast, Fast and Furious, Furious movie. movie. I can tell yes. you that. Yes, I I second that notion. I'm fucking killing it tonight, huh, you, boys? You yeah. are. Oh you my are. god, I am fucking good. Yeah, Whoa, you, I'm on fire. What? Too bad you can't bowl worth a shit. Oh, yeah. I'm a good bowler. <laughs> but you like, know what some guy told me the other day? What did he tell you? I told him I was going bowling. He's like, "You bowl a lot, huh?" And I said, "Yeah." And this is a really hot guy that works at Quick Trip. Mm. And uh, he goes. Gay or straight? <sighs> Can't tell. Can't, he said gotta, he's got a girlfriend. He's straight. So straight. He's straight, which is why I'm probably attracted to him. Oh, makes sense. Uh, <laughs> makes I don't like sense. gay people. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's so I, fucked, I, man. I, I hate it. I, I, it. I just yeah. don't. Uh, uh, one of my best friends is the same. Yeah. Way. <laughs> so I was like, uh, "Is it the?" Challenge? I was like, "I'm going bowling." He's like, "Are you good? You must be really good." I said, "Yeah, man." I said, "I really am." I said, "I'm actually a pretty good bowler." And he goes, "Well, I heard you were either good at bowling or good at giving head." And I was like, <laughs> that was, yeah, he, was, he was trying to feel it out. <laughs> so I said, well, you I'm okay fun, at yeah. bowling. <laughs> <laughs> and then winked at him and left. And I haven't seen him since. <laughs> it's time to go back. No, yeah. he's been there. But every time I go in, he's not around. Uh, like I'm he's sure. Hiding yeah. cooler or something. But I, I wouldn't have even done that. I'd have cut straight to the chase. It'd have been just yeah, like, well, I'm I gay. Probably so, yeah. yeah. I think he pretty much knows I'm gay, though, because my best friend uh, manages that store. One of my best friends does. So I, okay. I think he knows I'm gay. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Plus, then that I makes skip sense. in and out. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Every time. Wearing heels? Well, sometimes. Sometimes, sometimes okay. heels. Not uh, the rain. Not wedgie. the easiest to skip in in the rain. Oh, God. Right. Okay. That makes sense. But yeah, no, it's it's kind of funny because even listeners still to this day think that's an ongoing bit that we just overplay. Right. That I'm not really gay. <laughs> no, really. Yeah. And I've told them all. Oh, I will suck them. your dick to prove it. <laughs> <laughs> but nobody hits me up. Call still. five five five. Yeah. <laughs> five 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 five. That's right. Um anyways, okay, so uh yeah, we'll move on from that. Mm. Fuck you, Vin Diesel. Yeah, Stop it. Please. Yes. I, well, actually one one last thing on that. Do you think it's kind of like I, I hate to like compare these two things, but like John Wick. Oh, the John Wick movies are dope. Okay, so Maybe not. There's John, only three no, 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 of them, no, right? no. Kidnapped, Four. kidnapped. Four is, now. Kidnapped is what I'm thinking. Isn't that with uh, taken? taken? Taken. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Is like, there more than one of those? There's yeah, three. there's three of them. How many yeah. times? Can, how many times <laughs> how this motherfucker got to be taken yeah. before you fucking get some extra security? Oh, shit. That's my point. Yeah, that, that I is mean, exactly my point. Yeah. That, so it's like, how many fucking? Time, I've never seen any now of those. It's, now it's like, okay, Fast and the Furious. Now we have ten of these movies, and you're making fucking two more. Taken seventeen. This time it's the cat. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Give me back my cat, you son of a bitch. Which is John Wick. Yeah. yeah. Right. Fucking Coincidentally, dogs. they merged the two. That's yeah. Right. And then Vin Diesel comes flying <laughs> in and is fucking. <laughs> he's Charlie. the one that has the cat. Yeah, and a fucking skyline uh, that has Nas in the back. I think we need to write that movie. I, we I mean, fucking I'll tell you what, it was, Yeah. We've got some good ideas on this show. I think right. so. Uh, okay, next one. Uh, I thought this was fucking hilarious. There was a woman that tweeted out, and she, and I quote, says this she says i went out in a tight shirt with no bra and caught men looking at my boobs and i was disgusted well, yeah, she what should the be. fuck did you think was gonna happen <laughs> she maybe she thought that you were gonna be decent people and not fucking stare at her tits Have you know you been I mean, around the past 50 years no shit okay there is a reason we are attracted to boobs. It's just you. You want to? I t- even like boobs. Everybody <laughs> likes boobs. Yeah, right. They're great. I wish I had a set. I'm sure you do. You can buy them. Yeah, I know. Not the same. Okay, all right. If they're your own, it's probably right. weird, it's right? Better. No. But no. What What do you fucking yeah. think's gonna happen when you go out topless? Like everybody's talking about this, like free the nipple. And you know, thing. it was a white shirt, and she was like spraying herself. Oh, yeah. One hundred percent. It's nipples. Oh, Eat all this attention. Y'all are disgusting. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah. You attention grubbing whore. You knew exactly you know what you, you were doing. You know who you don't see complaining about stuff like that? Who? Like really old, overweight women with no bras on that their titties uh, basically hang, hang out of their out shirts. Shirt. They don't give a fuck if you. 100%. You know what I mean? But yeah. They, the, the girls miss prissy uh, with the nice titties that you really want to look at of course that's of course. what's gonna happen oh man i can't remember what they're calling this person but uh, it's I, I made a joke about her and called called her job of the hut but there is this severely overweight person that uh is now like making huge leaps and bounds of popularity in twitter and all of the other social media and she is probably 350 400 pounds but going out to clubs and trying to I believe her name is Lizzo. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I think is who you're referring to. Twin she, sister of Lizzo. Yeah. <laughs> but I think they call her Golgoth the, the Destroyer or some shit like that. Golgoth the Destroyer, <laughs> that is which is fucking name. phenomenal. Whoever <laughs> came up with that. Go fucking follow <laughs> that's, that. That's very right. good. Very nice. <laughs> yes. Oh, I uh, like that. But she was <laughs> bitching in the back of an Uber because she knows that she's a 10, and but all of the guys just can't see it and, and like fake crying and being all this shit. I'm just like. It's fucking shallow how. What yeah, the right. fuck? 
She's trying to pull a shallow hat. Right up. God, she doesn't. It's like she's pulling cheeseburgers from stuffing her bra. She doesn't even have tits. It's just so oh, fucking bad. That's awesome. Oh, no, it's terrible. Uh, oh, well, moving on. Uh, speaking of the next one is uh, I saw this as well. Uh, overweight people are upset with being charged for two seats on airplanes. Also, not having amenities for overweight people at hotels or other public places. What do you think about that? Um, what amenities? Uh, like, you know, like, like the, the bathtub's not big enough. Yeah. Use the fucking pool, fat ass. <laughs> <laughs> that's why we fucking got that's it there. Why there. That's right. No, like even toilet seats. Toilet seats apparently are toilet too small. Seats. Oh, yeah. you would think that as a maid, you would be pushing for the bigger toilet seats. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, okay, that's funny because. Oh man, I see you're gonna get me and you get me talking about oh, stuff shit. like this, and go. I'm gonna get canceled. <laughs> oh, let's go! I, I'm all there for is it. somebody that I know that I have always wondered how, how? <laughs> like, how does the toilet just not disappear? <laughs> Like for sure, it's getting on oh, the sides, shit. you know, and not even on the. I'm talking about the outsides. I, I know it's getting on there. There's no way around it. It's it's 100. percent It has to. Yeah. Because well, I mean, what, yeah. I, it, I mean, obviously, you're not gonna like get it sucked up directly. I've had a <laughs> lot of things inside of me, but never a toilet. <laughs> I've been not, yet. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> <laughs> if I keep eating uh, those QT hot dogs, <laughs> I may get there. Uh, no. But yeah, man, I always wondered with this one person. I'm like, dude, I would all. <laughs> I just want to see not, how that works. And I think I think we're all guilty of it. And I don't know if this is one of those things that we all do. But I'm not. I'm not going to lie. Whenever I go to sit on the to toilet, don't you spread your cheeks apart? Hundred percent. Okay. All right. I'm just making mine. Just spread on their own. <laughs> Like, makes sense. I get it. Makes sense. Uh, but no, I, I really do. I think that you've got these people that are sitting there bitching and complaining because of a situation that they put themselves in. Uh, not always, man. Some Hold people on. have a thyroid problem. That is the biggest load of bullshit I've ever heard in my entire life. Oh, I have a thyroid problem. Yeah, okay, man. well, then eat right and exercise, you fat cunt. I'm so sick and tired of people doing this. This is fr very frustrating for me. And then have the audacity to bitch about it whenever they're buying. Uh, I mean, listen, you are in this particular situation because of either your, your choices or whatever. Don't make it our problem. That's your problem and just deal with it. <laughs> yeah, you fat asses. Exactly. I mean, Lizzo can buy a Dude, whole fucking first class seat all for her fat she self. Is, she is. Uh, honestly... All bullshit aside, she's one of the coolest people I've ever fucking. Liked. I know she does a lot of cool shit. She really does. She really yeah. does. I give her props yeah, for man. that. But when did she you, starts, did you see she's, she's got a show now? Oh, oh for great. the love of God! Yeah, great. more it's, stupid people. Is she on uh, Fast and Furious no, Eleven? No, no, no. It's her own show. It's like um, all about fat people like fat fat girl fucking Acceptance? power dude oh yeah and, celebrating yeah, yeah, obesity yeah, 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 yeah. and shit and they're right. all they're all in spandex and dancing around and i don't think it'd probably smell very good on the set <laughs> no. no i'm just guessing uh, yeah, man, she's got a show coming out listen uh, okay all jokes aside i think it's on amazon i do really feel bad for a lot of these people i really do i'm all jokes aside i really do feel bad for them but you really it seems like no it seems like no i i am it's, not going to celebrate this particular part of yourself i wish you the best of luck to try and make it better I don't make a, it my problem i got a That's, fat cock <laughs> does that count well, you want to celebrate that, that scotty yeah quit shoving fucking sausages in your face and start putting them in your ass that's that's kind of the way i'm thinking these things you will lose weight in a <laughs> with a quickness <laughs> ask jp for tips uh-huh uh different kind of tips other tips uh anyways Sausage and tips. uh i, I want to close on this one because i want to actually see what you guys think about this uh, so Netflix's uh, Queen Cleopatra documentary appears to have the worst audience scores in TV history per Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah, because they don't have any testimonials. What do you mean? There's nobody to fucking. <laughs> there's nobody to be <laughs> like, Scottish. yep, that happened. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? Oh, they're all dead? <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, don't know. Even Flat Earthers documentaries have higher shit than yeah, that. Yeah, dude. Speaking <laughs> of making shit up, they just came out with the people that did Planet Earth. Oh yeah, they started doing a like a Jurassic themed one, like what? I how, saw that. Yeah, yeah. That it's same actually. Guys. I'm like, 
I mean, it's pretty good, it, but how the fuck do you fuck know? You? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, fuck you! There's dinosaurs the out there making a. <laughs> the children path. swim across the river with the mother. Who fucking Ooh. says? <laughs> yeah. Says you? Making shit yeah, up. they're just making shit up, which I fucking love. Okay, I'm glad we're getting on this road. I'm starting to get really excited. So, uh, okay, let's stop. No, 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 because there's like a group of people that think like dinosaurs are fake. Uh, there's a bunch birds of people. Birds aren't. Birds are. Birds, birds are, are fake. Birds, are birds fake. aren't real. Yeah, see, there's a lot. Of That's true. Are you fucking kidding me? They right killed now? all the birds and now they're all. They're all spy government cameras, spy government, cameras. Got absolutely, it. every last one of them. <sighs> okay. Birds aren't real. Um, what, what more do you really believe in? How about dragons? Where are dragons at? <sighs> dragons are right below unicorns. Okay. All right. I'll, go, I think I'll bite. Dragons could have been a thing like at one point. I believe that. So I have a, I have a fun question to ask you. Yeah. I don't believe any of this shit. I'm saying this right yeah. out of the game because yeah. people are going to think I'm stupid. <laughs> but what if, what if the Tyrannosaurus Rex's arms are so short because he actually had wings that actually break down and that's why we don't find wings. They're hollow. How long <laughs> How? have you been doing this show <laughs> waiting for the exact waiting right for moment <laughs> to try and pretend like I'm fucking smart? <laughs> How long? Huh? Oh, man. I yeah. don't believe any I mean, of this. That could be. Yeah, you must. I think you believe it. I don't think yeah. you come up with a theory like that just out of the blue. I think you've been working on this one for a while. My Twitter is so fucked up. It's yeah, that's like, awesome. and, okay. and I get these kind of things. That could be a thing, man. And, and conspiracy theories kind of fall. I mean, one evolution. After yeah. Yeah. Evolution and stuff. Yeah, man. Right. Uh, but dragons had to go and dinosaurs are dragons. True. Now crocodiles are basically dragons. Those are because they're dinosaurs. Those are dinosaurs, yeah, dog. Yeah, one hundred percent. Those are dinosaurs. Yeah. But do you honestly? This is real. Do you honestly Sorry. think this is real? Do hold you your think, hold your popcorn, folks. Do you think there is a very large undiscovered like sea monster that we haven't discovered yet? I can't. I think you can't say there's not because right. there's we have, dude. Okay, so in just for perspective, we've discovered and and be careful at, with what you say because i think i know where you're going and it's totally a false statement we've looked at a, a, a certain percentage of space mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we've mapped it we've found planets we found solar systems we found whatever we haven't even touched the ocean percentage wise we we only know about 20 to 30 percent of what's in our oceans and we haven't even been to some of the places in our oceans we haven't been to anything per, past the moon either so be careful with but, i know well, a lot we of people we, we have but we can the cameras have and we sure. can see that i understand but i, I just be careful because whenever somebody says we've experienced more of the galaxies than we have of, of our true. own ocean for fuck's sake that's true Not, i don't i don't think experience is the right word but uh, we, yeah, yeah it, it, well, it's we, like we know we, we oh no perceive. they say we we know more about outer space than what we know about our actual oceans that's a that's a that's a that's a very a very popular statement it's bullshit yeah. we we have the ability to discover certain things in our oceans they just don't they decide not to fund that and decide to fund other shit which i understand so we should have an ocean force we totally Instead should. Instead of a space force. We, yeah, I, mean, I think it's it called up. the Navy. <laughs> but the main reason No wonder why. we haven't discovered very much. Right. Maybe. Have you ever met anybody in the Navy? They are not the brightest fucking people. <laughs> 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 Look, I mean, they, they fucking give gray head, but they are not, <laughs> not the brightest guys. <laughs> oh, come on. Some of the Navy guys are okay. Mm. Uh, I said some. Uh, but anyways, no, I, I, this is a fun joke because I, I'm so terrified of being in the ocean that yeah. I, I like Me not too, knowing, bro. I know I, I like not I, knowing. I don't like, like, I don't swim and shit like that mm -mm. anyway, mm -mm. but fuck all the, fuck the ocean. <laughs> I'm there. Fuck I'm that. There. Dude. I'm going for no my scuba way. diving. I'm swimming oh, with sharks. Yeah, oh, no, yeah. thank you. That's coming up in my I life. I would be terrified. You can fuck off so fast. Yeah, man. I'm, oh, I'm no. I will do it. I will do almost anything before I just get dropped out in the ocean. I get made fun of by a whole bunch of Aussies that live. I mean, they live, they're from Australia, and so they're around the ocean all the time. Yeah. And they see sharks, and they're like, oh, no, nah, mate. It's just a fucking shark. And I'm like, you kiss my fucking <laughs> how they, ass. How do they do it? What? How do they do it again? I say, quit being a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> yeah, all. That's, I love yeah. that they use cunt. That is their favorite word. I know, and I, I fucking love it. Love it. Uh, but yeah, anyways. 
Uh, well, that's that's all of the fun news that I have. Uh, Good deal. Tune in next week for more sports shit because uh, maybe the sports guys will be back on. Uh, but anyways, now we get to move on to overrated or underrated. Now we get to have fun. Aren't you? Exci- right. Aren't you excited? Yeah, yeah, I'm I read stoked. through them. So let's I'm, I'm let's just going fucking wing go. Okay, uh, first one. Overrated or underrated? A buffet of only pizza bagels. Depends. That's diet. If they're the frozen ones, like the fucking to- Tostinos. Yeah, uh-huh. fuck that. Okay. But if you're making your own pizza bagels, yeah, yeah, I'm in. Okay. They're way better. Okay. The frozen ones are fucking. If you don't eat them all right away, then they start getting hard after Blasphemy. they sit for a minute. Blasphemy. Yeah, they're not that great. Well, don't be a bitch and shove them in your face. You shove everything else in your face. Yeah, but like if I'm going to eat fucking pizza bagels, dude, I'm not eating a fucking six pack of them. I'm fucking eating like a fucking bag. Full. Okay, so then you do the, the you, you basically prepare your evening. You do the first six, eat six, but when you take them off, put another six on. No, you just keep man, that fucking that's cycle just fucking, going. That's work. Okay, that's fine. Too much work. Yeah. And me, uh, overrated because fuck pizza bagels. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, you, for, you're sitting here <laughs> fucking defending <laughs> pizza, you shit asshole. Out. <laughs> <laughs> fuck like, pizza bagels. Yeah, I, don't, I say overrated. Uh, bagels are for shitheads. I, I, the, if you get like the not bagels ones, okay, I'm in. But the pizza just pizza. Bagels, <laughs> just, <laughs> you think you're talking about pizza? Yeah, yeah. pepperoni. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, give me that. I don't okay. want bagels. How about yeah. you, Fred? I mean, I was going to. Uh, say depends, but completely opposite depends on the flavors. Okay, you know, I don't give shit if they're frozen or whatever. But if it's just the fucking triple meat, yeah, nah, I want something else. You know, really, it's a buffet. Okay, you said a buffet, so well, I'm, it's a buffet. I'm, so I'm, you I'm get all the don't have all the fucking flavors. Yeah, you, oh, get all the flavors. So yeah, that's, you can that's have them all. That's so a, then I go point. once a year, shit my brains out. Yeah, and call it good. That's good true. Deal. It's definitely a cleanser. You should try it. Uh, I have a move called the pizza bagel. <laughs> oh my god! I don't. Like we're we're going to need you to write that up <laughs> yeah. and propose it to us. Okay, all. <laughs> you got it. Oh, that's bad. Okay, uh, next one: overrated or underrated? Hungover morning sex on a waterbed. As long as it's just soaking, I think that's that's, <laughs> that's cool. But anything more than a soak on on that deal is not cool. Soaking on a waterbed? Yeah, that's cool. We're talking about the the, the like yeah. Amish soaking, right? Like from uh, that, from yeah. jury duty, right, right? From jury duty. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah, I think soaking would be cool. Oh, it's been a long time since I've been on a waterbed. Yeah, I was gonna say first, <laughs> the first, first red flag. They have a waterbed. Yeah. Maybe don't be there. And all the only ones I'm thinking about are the ones from the mid '90s. That not the ones with the mattress over it, to where it's kind of like a regular bed. No, I'm no, talking no, about no. the ones. Bladder. It's a straight just the bladder. bladder. No baffles, yeah. just bladder. It's fucking sober yeah. on a bladder is absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. There's no bounce to it. Uh, so that's gonna be overrated, no matter what the situation is uh for me fred i fucking any hungover sex overrated <laughs> <laughs> my ass first thing in hungover morning uh, oh, I, I want pizza bagels. Yeah. I want pizza yeah, bagels. That's, that's it. it. I want a whole buffet of them too. I, Don't be holding out on me just with one flavor. Just imagine getting like fucking. If you're one of those people who gets seasick and all of a sudden those pizza bagels starts coming up and you end up throwing them all over somebody while having sex on a waterbed. <laughs> so, uh, people might like that. And those nineties, <coughs> those nineties bladders have a way of getting food and other shit stuck Down in the in, there, in the yeah, corners dude. and stuff. Mm-hmm. By the way, you never get that shit out. So, anyways, all right. Next one, overrated or underrated? Putting googly eyes on your dick. I, I gotta say, I it usually clear. just draw mine in with marker. Right. I never thought about using the googly See, eyes. But That's I great. I didn't never draw eyes. I drew elephant ears. Oh, that works. Too. <laughs> yeah. I, I know a guy that has that tattoo. Does he? Yeah. That's the That's God's awesome. honest tree. Really has tattoo of elephant ears. I really honestly think that this is a million dollar business idea. I really do. Googly eyes for your dick? Kind of. Uh, you know how they have like um, like different kind of ears for Halloween costumes for dogs, like labs and shit like that, or the little arms for the chickens? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're saying. Okay. I think this would be an awesome dick idea. Arms. Yeah, dick arms or like dick ears or some shit like that, and just make a dick whole bunch ears. of we, yeah. dick we, ears. Yeah, dick ears. Dick ears. Yeah, I, I mean, don't know, no, but I, I'm going with it. I'm trying to figure uh, out what it's like because it's. I mean, I won't more not like wear costumes. them. Yeah, I won't not wear them. It's like cock I'll costumes. Be the spokes, I'll be the spokesperson. That's what we'll call them: is cock costumes. Because yeah. I think I think that's or a great dick idea. Wear. Right. Cock stooms. Yeah, Cock-stooms. <laughs> yeah. Because then you put you put the googly eyes on the head Dude, of the dick. Stop talking. What? 
people are gonna steal our idea. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, pretty much. We're, we're screwed we're now. They're cut that shit out. Yeah, let's cut, yeah. We need to cut this costume idea out. That's because true. Andrew Santino and Bobby Lee are like, up oh, yeah, stole that, that shit. Yeah, but at least you heard it here first. Okay, That's at least right. give us some credit. And maybe go. some royalties or something like that. But yeah, yeah, underrated as hell. How about you, Fred? Yeah, I've got to try something new now. Yeah, you know and. I think it'd be fun. Do you do you have to Dress shave it up. first? Like it depends. Does they stick on. It, de- it depends oh, on yeah, the it, event that you're going to. <laughs> it's 3M tape too, so they won't Can we fall make off. Can angry eyebrows and shit? Yes. Like, it's like uh, the command hooks. When you're done with it, you just pull the strip and it pops right off. Absolutely. Okay. That's I think All that's right. perfect. And I'm I think, in. I'm in. And if it's almost like a like a. Can um, they have? Can I have wigs? What wigs? Oh fuck you! Yeah. They, they have like a little clown wig. That's what I'm talking about. It's like a, it's nose. the They're same. Called Merkins. They're called Merkins. Merkins. I know, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, but it's like you're you're totally cutting off the the Merkin. For a long time, I didn't know the difference between a gherkin and a Merkin. <laughs> I don't know what, what's a gherkin. Is it a girl version? It's a pickle. Uh, a pickle. A what? A pickle. A pickle. Oh, on a, a small pickle. Yeah. Okay. You know, like, like the little charcuterie board. Charcuterie board. Okay. Yeah. I just want to make sure it's actually something you eat yeah. and not a yeah. sexual term. So right. I don't know. Well, you can eat a mer- you can eat a Merkin if you want to. <laughs> sure eat a fucking Merkin. You're gonna need a fun. fucking tall glass of water to wash it down. But. It's an 80 year old's pubes that she's cutting off for money. That's disgusting. Yeah. Uh, okay, but I think we all said underrated for googly eyes on yeah, your we're dick. There now. Okay, uh, next one: overrated or underrated? Hooking up with someone who is ten years older than you. I never uh, underrated. I don't think never. I that's think right. One You're, time. That's right. You went ten years younger. Sorry. Yeah, God, I'm. Damn it. Yeah, I like younger. I like younger guys. Good thing you said guys. Yeah. <laughs> never know and not kids i'm just no, no. i'm just fucking no, no they mama. have to no they have to be at least 18 <laughs> Fuck. i mean that's the most awkward question or within a couple weeks you know what <laughs> i mean that? like yeah. i'm gonna be 18 <laughs> nobody will find out for a couple weeks we're good i don't know about that yeah. uh, just, that's gonna be the most awkward question in the world it's like it's like jesus christ uh uh, JP, uh, your cousin's very, very attractive. And so, is she 18? Like that question right there is that loaded right you hook think, that's yeah. coming right behind it. Wait, you think that's awkward? Hi, how you? How do? Hell, yeah, I'm JP. Yeah. How old is your son? <laughs> yeah, that's way more awkward. <laughs> no, it's like. So how old is your kid? No, it's good looking kid. How, good looking kid. How is old he, is he? Is he 18? Yeah, yeah, that, that's and the one. Yeah, it's like fuck. Actually, right. he just turned eighteen yesterday. I'll be right Cha-ching. back. Cha-ching. <laughs> that's my so guy. fucking terrible. No, but my guy, ten years older. Would you want to be with somebody ten sure. years older? You're okay with that? Sure, I've been with older guys too. Okay, I, I, uh, it de- I mean, uh, there's a lot of guys that are ten years older than me that look fucking way better than me. Okay, not a lot. <laughs> Maybe a couple, but ten like percent. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. You're sure. A good looking guy. For me, it's a feel thing anyway. I don't. I gotta feel it. I yeah. gotta. I mean, just because you're pretty or you got a big dick doesn't mean I'm gonna suck it. That's it doesn't true. mean I'm not going to. <laughs> but <laughs> but I gotta feel it. You know. Yeah. Thank There's you. Got to be something there. Yeah. Thank you to whoever decided to send us a dick pic on Instagram. By the way, that uh, somebody did. Oh, for sure. Uh, I've been asking for those, and you didn't share it with me? I'll send it to you later. Please. It's not real. I've been begging for these guys. It's not. No, don't. <laughs> begging. No. Please send us your dick yeah. pics on Instagram, for no, God's sake. Yeah, bonus yes. for googly eyes. <laughs> that will be yes. the logo for yes. our please. <laughs> please send us dick pics with googly eyes on them. I beg of you. I beg. L-O-T. L-O-T. <laughs> Just tag JP. I'm going to put you as as a uh, uh, whatever yeah. you want. And tag me in it. That's fine. That's fine. As long as Scotty's got to see him first. <laughs> that's fine. I don't want any of them. That's perfect. No, because they're not even real. They're always pulled from the well, internet. Not if they got googly eyes on them. <laughs> that's, that's, how that's, how how that's how we know. That's how we know. Oh, my God. This is going to be weird. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to say. I'm what gonna, color was it? White guy. No, never mind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what, you've seen one. You've seen them all. <laughs> that's true. Uh, see one every day for myself. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I, I'm going to say this is actually underrated, especially if this is a coming of age kind of a yeah, tale. Cool. Um, and, and that's totally, totally underrated. But the ones who I really want to point out that I want to punch in the fucking face are the kids that are going to school and fuck their teachers. Shut the fuck up. Don't tell anybody. You're just jealous. 
No, yeah, yeah, I'm jealous. Right. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I love how I love how they're like, for shame on that teacher, and the kid's like, yeah, baby. The kid's like <laughs> fucking time. famous. Like the kid will, he's got high school. His whole high school career is made. It's made. And the other thing is, is it, it, you're kind of stupid for being the hot teacher for doing that because yeah. you're just like, yeah, don't tell anybody. This is a high school yeah. kid who just yeah. fucked his teacher. Right. They're tell gonna them. tell don't everybody. Tell. They're telling everybody. They just hit the peak of popularity. Oh, for high sure. There's, Don't fucking yeah, do it. They're posting it on Instagram. Absolutely. Maybe snapping some secret pics. Oh, yeah, yeah. So underrated for me. Fred? Okay. It's fucking underrated. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. All of us. Uh, all right. And last one. Overrated or underrated? Rosie O'Donnell's phone sex line. <laughs> it's just her fucking shoveling burgers <laughs> and donuts. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What are you yeah. wearing right now? Yeah, yeah. Uh, very overrated. <laughs> I don't know. I think it could kind of make... No, it's, it's, yeah. way, it's way overrated. I don't know how anybody could go underrated on that. <laughs> no, it, that's... Uh, would be it's scary. All, it's all bad. Man, they're selling Taylor Swift contacts. They're selling... Yeah, they're, they're selling that. Phone sex. Oh, don't true. get me wrong. Oh, I'm sure people will do it. I would Why? totally do it and record it just so I can share it with all my friends. I don't know how that would go. Why? <laughs> I don't like this at all. <laughs> 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 I don't like this idea yes. at all. I'd like, I'd like JP to call in and be like, what are you wearing? <laughs> oh, that's right, baby. Yeah. Move, move aside. Lick your, that frosting. Yeah. yeah. Move aside your Merkin. What kind of ice cream is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Chunky monkey or rocky road? I'm 10 years older than you. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that is overrated or underrated. Uh, again, guys, if you have any of these, I know I've been a shithead the last couple of weeks because I haven't looked. So I'm hoping those these are piling up so I can have a lot to go through. But you can send them to us now on our Twitter, which is at LOT Sidelines or at uh, Laughing on the Sidelines on Instagram. Send them to us on there. I do actually look through all of them, including the fucking dick pics with googly send eyes. Them. Yeah, send those send for them. sure. Screenshot, send, send to JP. You can just send them straight to Scotty's phone. 316. Nope, stop. I'll yeah. fucking kill you. If you put your Venmo on there. No. Yeah, no. Yeah, there no. you go. We, we might be able to compensate you. Yeah, oh yeah. Venmo or, yeah, no, uh, not that. No, I, I want, uh, you can send them to us, but if they're dick pics and they don't go directly to JP, I'm going to snap it and send it to them, but then you're blocked forever. So that's Depen how that's Depends. Work. I'll let you know. Okay. Right. <laughs> I'll let you know if we're blocking them or not. Oh, this could be really bad and I don't want any. Or they're going to be, we can get them a new, one of those badges, super fan badges. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They either get canceled or they get a super fan badge. I, one of the two. Please, for the love of God, don't send them to me. Please. Mm, I beg of it. you. It, it, it could be all bad. Somebody does it and they're saying Please, for the love of God, just do it. Don't. <laughs> oh. Anyways. Uh, this is our new segment that we get to move on to that I'm very excited about. This is called, yeah, I'm that guy or fuck that guy. These are going to be particular Why people. Why can't it be both? <laughs> Maybe it could be, uh, but these are going to be gonna find out. about personalities of certain people that you are either that guy or you fucking hate that guy. And so we're going to start with the very first one. Uh, first one, the parent that ridicules his son when he strikes out three times at T-ball. Hashtag Jeremy Joseph. Um, yeah. I'm that guy. <laughs> it's fucking T-ball, you fucking moron. It's if you right can't there. do this, you are fucking, you're done. If you can't do this, there's no fucking hope for anything else. Yeah, three times. Jesus Christ, once is too many. In baseball, we call that a golden sombrero. That's what yeah. it's called. Three strikeouts in a game, you, you get the golden sombrero. But T-ball. But if you strike yeah, out three man, times in T-ball. You deserve whatever you get. Even though yeah, I'm fuck that guy. that guy. No, yeah, I'm that guy. Even though fuck that guy, it's like I kind of get it, dog. Yeah, I'm that guy. I kind of get it. So uh, I'm in the I'm in the between of this particular one. How about you, Fred? Nah, fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. Fuck, that guy. fuck sports. Fucking T ball. I don't give a shit. Fuck, fuck, shit. fuck no. T ball. Fuck, fuck his kid. Fuck, fuck his fuck kid. kid. <laughs> he shouldn't even be out there. Fuck no. We He's on the right. damn bagel. I think Fred's on the fuck that guy side. <laughs> You know, the thing is, like, T-ball, back when you're, like, four and five years old, that's, like, a co-ed team. So can you imagine, like, a dad ripping his daughter a new asshole? If she can't hit off a tee, yeah. <laughs> I think he should. Fine. Fair enough. All right. Next one. Uh, the drunk guy at the lake that passes out in odd places. I know that fucking answer. Yeah, I'm that guy. Yeah. <laughs> you seem like that. You'd be that guy. That shit. Yeah. 
I, I, it's the thing I do, man. I, and it's not even like at the picnic table. No, no. Oh, fuck no. He goes and leans up against the truck and passes out. I, I, yeah. I dude, it, it, and, and I'm well, not. This is this is now nine weeks of non alcohol, nice. so I'm wow. I'm good. But when I went to the lake, man, and I'm hanging out with Fred on a regular basis, You're getting drunk. I'm getting yeah. fucked because I know I'm going to be taken care of because he he normally can stay under control for the most part. So I honestly think my brother's just a great guy. He's not going to fuck okay. with me. I get fucked with whenever I do it sometimes. So, it, But I, I do. I pass out in like weird fucking places. I think I, I passed out on, a, on like a tire swing one time. Uh, I passed out in the, anywhere. in the bed of the truck. And, and I, oh, I, I passed out on a, on a dog bed one time. And I, all I had was my boxers on. That was it. Yep. Yep. So, we got a picture of that one. Yeah, we do. I do. All right. So, anyways, yeah, uh, I'm that guy. Well, now that I know you're that guy, fuck that guy. <laughs> okay? Fuck that guy. Is that a fuck that guy or I want to fuck that no, guy? That's a fuck that guy. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thank God. So. That hurt. Uh, how about you, Fred? I'm right in the fucking middle. I mean, you, I can't say fuck that guy because it's you. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm always stuck in the fucking middle right. taking care of you. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I'm definitely it. not that guy. Yeah, Fred, Fred's take care of that guy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't right. even take care of you like. Did I find him? Okay, fuck it. Yeah, he's he, good. He's he's breathing. He's breathing. He's alive. He shit. All right. Next one. The pessimistic guy who brings <laughs> everyone else down. <laughs> Hold on, because you're loud. You got everybody has to hear it, so we know. But it is the pessimistic guy who brings everyone else around them down. Fuck that fuck guy. That guy. Fuck I'm guy. glad he's doing baseball tonight. <laughs> I don't know who we talking about. In this Derek. Are we oh, sure? Gee. Yeah, we're definitely talking about no. God damn. I was looking at the definition yeah. after this that particular is Derek. example. Is there a picture of Derek when, yeah. <laughs> when, you <Google laughs> when you Google that? Magically, I have time to edit today, so guess There will be now. There will be yeah, now. Yeah, Derek's Can you just right put, here. Yeah, just put Derek's face over Fred. <laughs> I fucking Good saw for that one. I, I, yeah, fuck that guy. I saw it, and if you kept on reading the explanation, I didn't want it to be too long. Yeah. But it even goes on to say, a person who shoots down everybody else's ideas, but comes up with absolutely nothing to replace them with. And I was like, this is fucking spot on. This is horseshit. Uh. So, so yeah, fuck that guy. How about you, Clayton? Fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. And JP. Clayton. Yeah, Clayton. Oh, Fred. Sorry. Yeah. Middle oh. name, He's both. Name, middle name. I got two names too. No. <laughs> I bet that's not all we have in common. I'm sure. Right. No, yeah, I inches. said fuck that guy. Oh, uh, you did say fuck. Around. It's like a wheel of cheese. It's like a wheel of cheese. <laughs> it's not very, it doesn't come very far out. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> we call that a cheese. like a wheel of cheese. <laughs> I love cheese. <laughs> uh, yeah, fuck that guy. Thank God. All right. Uh, next one. The guy that says he's going to be at something but always flakes out. Yeah. JP? Am I that guy? Sometimes. I might be that guy. <laughs> I'm not, well enough. I, I say I am that guy. I got to go with I am that guy because I do that shit. Because, man, I'm, I'll be real gung-ho for something, and then the time will come to go and actually do it. I'm like, ah, fuck that. I'll just stay home and get high instead. <laughs> <laughs> I've got very little motivation. I don't know why. Get, okay. Uh, so I I'll, am that guy. I'm going to go last. What, do you, what about you, Fred? Uh, it's, it's so hard. I'm definitely not that guy. Yeah. But two of my best friends are. Yeah. And fuck, if you know who you are, I'm sorry. You know who you fucking are. <laughs> you know who you but are. I'm just like, I can't call them. That they'll just fucking yep. make up some bullshit, bullshit. flake out. Yeah, so I, I know. I, I, so the reason why I wanted to go last because I, I honestly, I, I have to point out Jeremy Joseph. We needed, we needed all the comedians to be there in order for Jeremy Joseph to throw out the first pitch, which is happening this Friday at Riverfront Stadium, barring the fucking weather holds up. Uh, but. I asked you if you were going to be able to go, and you I were like, on and he planned on and then going, I got sick. and he got. <laughs> no, I really did. I was sick. He got. I was real sick. Sick. Yeah. He yeah. spelled high wrong, yeah. uh, but he didn't make it. How fucking ever? If I call or text JP and say, "Hey, buddy, so and so is not going to be here," or if it's just, "Hey, man, you want to do the show this week?" There is nobody more fucking like rock solid that I can depend on. Than you, you are the. I, that's what I'm saying. I'm well, not, fuck you too. Well, I, I, <laughs> yeah. I know you have a life. 
JP does oh, it. Oh, oh, shit. Somehow lie. this just turned <laughs> like a did a complete it 180. It was a backhanded this, compliment. Yeah, somehow this just took a turn. <laughs> just real quick. Oh. Yeah, so next I'm, time. I'm so sorry. It. Please tell me about your week week one more time. Okay. <laughs> Wait, did you get high? I, a little. Yeah. A little high. Was it Kush? Yeah. Was it? Oh, uh, yeah. For, yeah. <laughs> it was Kush. No, but I do Get got... Into the dabs? Oh, the like, best. This, no, this, I, only, I only smoke real weed. I'm 45 years old. Yeah. So that's true. I don't, I'm not with all this new <laughs> no, fangled too much dabby work. dabs yeah, and no. yeah, vaporized pens. I won't yeah, do I none of that shit. Yeah, fentanyl, I'm scared of... Like I'm so terrified of it, so I am. I'm not. Yeah, but anyway, I do. Uh, honestly, I, I thank you very much for being very dependable. Yeah, man. And, because and rock solid. Consistent. I am that guy. I am that guy to just be like, eh. right? Exactly. But I almost did it tonight. <laughs> yeah. But, but, no. But, but seriously, can you make it this Friday when Jeremy throws out the first pitch? I can't, man. <laughs> you know I can't. We've already talked about this, but you I'm asshole. Bum. I know. I'm just kidding. Yeah. Uh, but no, seriously, uh, if you guys can make it to Jeremy Joseph, I, I'm hoping the weather, mm. I know it looks kind of shady, but if it goes on, we would love to actually meet a lot of you. And I know there's going to be a lot of comedians that are going to be there that have been on the show and some future guys. So if anybody's wearing googly eyes, <laughs> I'll come by after work. I'm sure he <laughs> yeah. will. Uh, but yes, uh, this Thursday. So that's the night. I'm sorry. Friday. 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 This Thursday, Friday. Thursday. I could fucking make <laughs> this Friday night at uh, Riverfront Stadium in Wichita, Kansas. Please. If you are a fan of ours, you are going to want to be there because this is going to be fucking hilarious. I can already see the people who have no clue what's going on going 1984 Kingman County T-Ball Defensive Player of the Year. <laughs> this is going to be gold. So anyways, uh, be there. Uh, let's see. Last one. The guy who has to ask his significant other if it's okay to hang out with the boys. Boyfriend, dog. Right. Yeah. I'm that guy. I am that guy. Cause, Cause, I can blame her for getting me out of right. it. Right. Okay, that's I a, am that guy. okay. That's a that's a curveballed question, yeah, I, I guess. Like okay, oh, that was a great answer. Yeah. Fuck that guy. I <laughs> like the the ability to do whatever I want, whenever I want, and if my wife doesn't like it, she can come with. I don't know how you are married to her. <laughs> yeah, we, we she is so good. Every she time is we so much out. better than so you. So much better. Uh, she deserves. Dick oh, she in her de she deserves so much better. Maybe he has in dick pics with googly eyes on him. You never know. You got a good zoom? Uh, those are awfully small eyes. <laughs> Microscopic. <laughs> I'd like to see those Google. <laughs> it seems like those wouldn't Google very much. They, they're hard to find. They're but just the pupils. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're hard to find, but you can get them on, man, yeah. on Amazon, okay. actually. All right. uh, but no, fuck those guys. I like, and, and I really do. It's called respect. Huh? It's called well, respect. What the fuck is that? Right. Yeah. -E exactly. <laughs> no. Find out what it means to me. Not a goddamn thing. And so, no. <laughs> so, okay. fuck that guy. Yeah. How about you guys? Well, I am that guy. You I'm are that, that guy? guy? Yeah, for sure. Yep. You're no fun. Yeah, it just, it just really sucks. Like, my situation. <laughs> I don't have a significant <laughs> other. <laughs> Do you want to go out tonight? <laughs> uh, fuck that guy. <laughs> Some some new dude in your life's like no, yeah. absolutely not. Well, he would fuck you. He wouldn't say it like that because I would. like dudes. Oh, dude, dudes, dude, yeah. dudes, dude, dudes. Yeah. dudes. Got like it. Like Fred, bears. Oh, like Fred. Give me bud. Okay, all right. Well, that is the new segment. Can, can I add one? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. You want to save for it for sure. your next segment? Just because this is a home opener. Okay. For fuck that guy. Okay, no, absolutely. Come on, man. So the guy. At the party that plays the fucking guitar. I was going to do fuck that one. Fuck that, that guy. guy dude. Fuck that guy. Fuck, fuck that, guy. that guy. Fucking that Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> oh, man. Every, every fuck fucking party I go to, Matthew's over there playing his fucking Always guitar. In uh -huh. Always in the corner. Fucking McConaughey. Fuck that guy. Yeah, fuck that guy. Yeah. And they never know the whole fucking no, song. No, they just no. know the chorus. Yep. Exactly. Yep. yep. And yep. It's, it's stupid. It, fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. All right. That was a good addition. I really was. like this one a lot. We're going to keep yeah. them coming. Again, if you have any suggestions for this one, if you have a real situation, this is an, this is one that's going to stick cool. around. Yep. I almost yeah. guarantee yeah. I like this one. If you send it with a dick pic, we will <laughs> oh, yeah. use it. Uh, we will we use it will on the use show. It. <laughs> Please, for the love of God, don't. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Now we get to move on to questions and preguntas. Uh, send them to us at laughing. I'm sorry, at laughing on the sidelines on Instagram or at LOT sidelines on Twitter. First one, 
Rejected toy, or sorry, rejected sex toy names. My shit. Okay. But I'm going with it. I'm just straight up drill dough. Okay. That one's already taken. Yeah. And I so figured. It's it's taken. I'm, taken. I'm, and I'm going googly eyes. <laughs> Dick. Fuck you. Then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Put that on there. No, I I uh, I don't know if it's taken, but it needs to be. And that is the thunder dong. Is that is that a real thing? I, I bet it is. It's I mean, gotta it's be. gotta be. I mean, I know That's some. Too easy. I know. I've heard some weird ones. I've heard of Mister Fister. Have you heard the of Mister? F- <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! Fister. Let me tell you. He, he raised his fist in joy. Uh, the he first says, Let time. Let me tell you something. The about first that guy. time I saw the Mister Fister, I wasn't. I just came out not that long ago. Oh, Jesus. I had only had like I'd only had that kind of sex once. I was horrified. <laughs> I was like, there's no way that would ever fit. <laughs> and now I've got to use two. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, yeah. I, I don't know what it's called, but there's a famous picture of two girls in their bathroom taking a uh, picture, like a selfie of themselves, and they forgot that there is what I like to call a sister fister in the, the back. Sister <laughs> fister. Double edged fist. Double edged fist. Oh, the sister fister. <laughs> so I was like, I think oh, that's a good answer right I, there. I, I the like sister that one. fister. I yeah. like that one too. How about yeah. you, Fred? Oh, and I'm sorry. How about I you, J? How about you, JP? I don't think I can beat the sister fister. <laughs> man. I don't that's, think so. uh, that's fucking tough. Yeah, that's tough. Yeah, wow. Scotty with the win for once. Was, I'm going to let you have it. I'm just not even going to answer would, that one. I'm going to let you have that. Never fucking I know. happens. God. It's because Derek's not damn, here to I, shit on your dreams. I know. That's true. <laughs> the <laughs> Fister Fister. I love it. Sister Fister. Got I'm going to fucking make one. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right. Uh, next one. What's a rejected name for a rectal thermometer? The Tushy Temp Taker. T- triple T. <laughs> yeah. T cubed. Uh, how about you, Fred? Uh, freaking what a uh, dipstick! Oh yeah, I like that one. I like that a lot. How about you? Thumbkin. The what? Thumbkin. 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 Yeah. You just take it with your thumb. Here is my, Thumbkin. My thumb. Here is my thumb thumbkin. can tell you what you the know, temperature is. That song. Where is Thumbkin? Not you know really. No. no. From kindergarten. Nineteen eighties is when I was. Oh born, god damn it! <laughs> just, okay, don't, man. don't even fucking lie. Can we edit this out? Can we edit this out, man? I was born. You're born. You're right. You're right. I, I thought you, I thought you oh didn't live. Like no. I was like, get me out of here. I was 11. Hold then, on a second. Yeah. Hold on a second. We're gonna go back to fuck that guy, okay. <laughs> or I'm that guy. When you're born in the ye- the last year of a particular decade, and say I'm a that kid. So I was yeah, born. Fuck that guy. I'm in, I was born in 1987. Right. No. Fuck that guy. And I you call my no. No. claims he's the 80s. I, he's I'm not. He's kid. not even close. I, I am a 90s, a 90s kid. kid. Yeah. I am a 90s kid. For sure. My brother-in-law, my wife's brother was born in uh, 1989 on New Year's and Eve. He says he's an 80s guy. Says he's yeah. an 80s kid. Fuck you. Fuck that guy. Fuck you. Fuck that guy. I'm barely an 80s kid. You just wanted to tell your wife's brother to fuck off. Kind of. So yeah. good. Yeah. It worked out for you. It's all right. Get a he, job. He doesn't good listen anymore. Get a he job. <laughs> uh, move out of the house. Uh, anyways, all right. Next one. Uh, what's something you did as a kid that you still do today? I think we're all the same. Probably. Masturbate. Oh, I didn't do that as a kid. I didn't figure it out till late. <laughs> what, in your 20s? Oh, no. No. I mean, I mean when it, teenager. Yeah, that's, that's a, a kid. kid, bro. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah. <laughs> we're not talking three-year-olds. Right. They, they only mean, suck on tongues at right, that age. Right. At that age, all you can do is suck the... Touche. Yeah. I'll there do that you one. go. Yeah, that was a good one. Uh I yeah, I I still I still laugh when I see people get hurt. Yeah. Every okay. fucking time. Okay. Yeah. I mean, and now granted it has to be the right kind of hurt. You know, no no broken bones going the wrong direction, nothing like that. But like face plants, belly flops and nut shots yeah, are right. my well, get down. I think that's the thing. I think that Every came time. from growing up in the 90s right. with yes. AFV. Right. Oh, a- yeah. You know, so yeah, AFV. Yeah, yeah. We watch yeah. that every Friday night. Absolutely. Nut shots were the best. How about you, JP? I still sister fisting. Yeah, yeah. still still use the sister fister, just like I did when I was a five year old. No, I uh, still eat macaroni and cheese straight out of the pan 
with the spoon that oh, I used to yeah. stir it with. Yeah, the big ass I'll spoon. Give you that one. Still to this day. Did it when I was a kid, still do it to this day. When I did it as a kid, it was so I wouldn't have to fucking clean so many dishes. But as an adult, it's so I don't have to clean so many fucking dishes. That's right. I feel yeah, like this could be I do. this could legitimately be a draft. This could be a draft. It really could yeah. be. Put a star beside that one because it could be. Yeah. It really kind of could be, but uh, but yeah, yeah, that's that's what I do as a kid and uh, now. Okay, that's, we haven't decided the draft yet, so we'll figure it out. Uh, but anyways, next one. No, we did. It's uh, worse. Uh, than okay, <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Whoopee. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> next one. What song summons your inner stripper? Wop. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But for. So, Lad. Wob or lad. Lad. Right, yeah. Right. You got you to call back to the yeah. lad, man. got to call back to the lad. Little ass dick. Little ass dick. <laughs> that's right. Good, good. At least he does some shit that's funny. Oh, he does a lot of stuff that's funny. Uh, miss you, Derek. I Not just really. wish he'd do it on the show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Uh, how about you, Fred? Uh, I mean, straight up, pour some sugar on me. Ooh, okay, I like it. I like it. Was, Sticky I, sweet. Yeah, I can Sticky remember. Sticky sweet. I love that. Nice. College, they'd serve Boone's Farm. You could buy the bottle at the club. <laughs> Boone's Farm. You could buy the bottle at Boone's the club. Farm, straight up. And I was so shit. Let's give it up for our man Fred with the Boone's <laughs> Farm. <laughs> <laughs> Last song came on, and I had two bottles of Boone's. One oh, each that's hand. Strawberry yeah. Hill, yes, baby. That's yeah, right. Yeah, that's I Strawberry Hill. Oh, man. <laughs> God damn it. Snow Creek Berry. That was yeah, my yeah. Favorite. Snow Creek Berry. Yeah. Yeah. Boone's Farm. That is the I most. I like the apple one. I can't remember which one it was called. That is the most white good. trash one oh, man. of all time. We used to buy time. it by the fucking case. Oh, bro. hell yeah. Sure yeah. Fucking, you did. Yep. fucking smash. People in Texas and Ohio and California are going, fucking white trash <laughs> redneck pieces. Yep. You got and then it, when right. I got older, it was Cisco. You remember Cisco? No. no. That was they the, that banned was, it. That was the rapper with silver hair. No, this was before him. But oh, okay. It was called Cisco. It was a wine. 80s kid. But, dude, they, <laughs> yeah, they banned it. You can't oh, even did they? It. it was killing kids. Jesus I remember. Do, uh, yeah. Was it Dos Locos? I remember those. It, this locos. was worse. Four, four, locos. Locos. four, four this, locos. This the Cisco was the four locos of my generation. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. Four locos killed. Yeah. Four crazy kids. Yeah. Uh, all four. right. Uh, mine is definitely. <laughs> says a yeah. lot that does yeah i gotta ha- i gotta have a i have a have to have a pounder of bud light before i do that i though. like that absolutely uh just a one couple and then easy? he slips on that mini skirt <laughs> <laughs> heels heels and he goes and, the, and the googly tan. eyes and on the, the dick yeah you gotta yeah. have that all right uh all right uh next one the name for that special drawer in your nightstand my no no box <laughs> your no no box I kind of like that one. That's actually. a good one. That's actually better than mine. Yeah. yeah. I'm not surprised. The dong. <laughs> yeah. The dong dungeon. The dong dungeon. Yeah. Okay. The, I'm going to need a bigger drawer. To, yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Go go off the destroyer. Yeah. Or, go back to guys, the destroyer. Guys, I like that. <laughs> yeah. Go off no, the destroyer. Be. That's going to be yours. Yeah. I like hey, Winner. <laughs> that's right. All right. The lube yeah. lock box was the yeah. other one I got. Okay. All right. And uh, last but not least... If you were to star in a relatable commercial for a new product or service, what would it be? Yeah, it's a tough one. That's a real tough one. I don't do shit. <laughs> you don't? Fuck no. Oh no. You you would definitely I'm a, I'm a have shitty one. golfer. I would have mine would have to be a weed delivery service. <laughs> Absolutely. And yeah. I think that's a great product. It needs to come out. Totally con- you know, yeah. like uh inconspicuous. I think they've got it. That's not the right word. <laughs> Totally inconspicuous. <laughs> totally inconspicuous. Uh, no, what's the word where it's like uh, secure? Uh, I don't know. Confidential. Totally that's the, confidential. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. It's like yeah. very similar. Anonymous. Yeah. Very similar. Very similar. <laughs> yeah. Not even don't close. Don't be suspicious. Don't be <laughs> suspicious. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm gonna have a, a van that's decorated like a dog, mm-hmm. and then I'm just gonna drive that around and deliver weed. Deliver weed through it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I think Call it puffs. Puffs. Yeah, yeah, that'd I mean, be good. Puffs. Rather than muffs, yeah. muffs, puffs. Right. Yeah, I like yeah. that. That's good. Um, I think in the future, the technology is going to be good enough to where you can legitimately give a child a pill, and once they have it, and it takes about like fifteen to twenty minutes to kick in, they can't talk. I would be perfect for that. Nobody wants. They to have those. Do they? They're called roofies. I use them all the time. <laughs> I use them all the time. 
<laughs> here, here, I'll bring you some. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. E- it's a sweet tart, I promise. Yeah. E- either that or something that like makes uh, little people's legs longer, like straight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but just the legs. Just the fucking legs. <laughs> Everything <laughs> else stays the same. Everything else stays Dude, the same. I, I got short legs, great. man. I'm like a little leprechaun. I, I get around, but uh, yeah, that's, uh, yeah. You just look like a midget on stilts. <laughs> that's exactly what I look like. <laughs> I look like. So many people that came up to me for the very first time and met me for the first time. The first thing is like, Jesus Christ, you are short. No fucking shit. I am short. Uh, how about you, Fred? I mean, it's it's got to be what suits my personality. Oh, yeah. And I'm thinking that's Mentos. Mentos, the, the fresh, fresh, maker. fresh maker. Because of how okay. cheesy those commercials Mentos are. Mentos commercials would be fucking fun to make. I could do that in a heartbeat. Oh, yeah. Those are fucking good. The one where they actually make like the the, the chase scene from Bloodsport. Yeah, yeah, And yeah, John yeah, Claude yeah. Van Damme is yeah. running through the street, yeah. and it turns out to be a Mentos, Mentos commercial. Fresh after maker. Jeremy should have a pack of Mentos for after he throws the first pitch, he just turns around. <laughs> fucking, yeah, dude. <laughs> fucking, yeah. I'm going to ask, I'm going to ask if there's something along those lines that we can do, but I got pretty goddamn good footage of him and I, oh God, I can't wait for you guys to see this shit. Okay. Uh, well that is our questions and preguntas for this week. Again, you can send them to us at L O T sidelines on Twitter or at laughing on the sidelines on Instagram. Send them to us. Let us know. No dick pics, please. Please. All dick pics. Nope. Uh, only with googly eyes. Do your job, people. <laughs> we don't ask that much from you. We don't get you. paid for this shit. Yeah. Right. Uh, but now we get to move on to a very popular part of every single episode. This is our Laughing on the Sidelines draft. All right, ladies and gentlemen. We have this week's laughing on the sidelines. Derek hates that, by the way. You I can see why. <laughs> uh, makes sense. Makes sense. <laughs> makes sense. Uh, no, we have the uh, laughing on the sidelines draft this week. Uh, last week, Derek uh, won. Can you believe that? I, I fucking, <laughs> I don't know how the guy does it. Actually, I'm, I'm kind of shocked this time because, believe it or not. I thought our, I was going to do really well. Our draft got taken down off of Facebook. <laughs> did it really? It really did. Apparently. I, I wonder why. Yeah. Uh, well, it was how, why you could get fired at work. And yeah. I think mine was the best pick because I said racial slurs. Right. And I think and that's, that's what, what got us Maybe. Down. I don't know. But uh, Twitter, on the other hand, good going. If you're not yeah. following us Twitter, on Twitter. They don't give a fuck <laughs> what you put on Twitter anymore. It, it's almost. It's yeah. um, All of our shit is eventually going to be moving over to Twitter. So do us a favor and follow us at uh, L O T sidelines because that's probably where a majority of our shit's gonna go because they don't give a fuck and that's why we like them. <laughs> they understand what comedy is, right, JP? That's right. That's right. Uh, okay, so last week uh, Derek won the draft. Uh, I got second by a narrow margin. You uh, mean I got last? You again? got last I, again. I, shocker! I never win, man. <laughs> Fucking shocker! Mm. And uh, while JP has been here consistently uh, for the last uh, several weeks, and we normally allow the guests to have the first pick, uh, Fred has actually won some of these drafts as oh, a guest. Yeah, I have. Okay. So, well, fantastic. Good job, Fred. We are actually. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> fuck that guy. Fuck that fuck guy. Fuck that guy. <laughs> uh, but uh, so this particular juncture, I think it only fair that that the guy that never, never has wins. won. I won once. You get. Oh, did you? Yeah, like maybe the first or second time I was ever on, oh, I won. Congratulations. But then I wasn't on again for like three months yeah. or something. Well, since then, we forgot about yeah, it. So right. so we're, we're kind of going to go give, give you the handicap right. this week. You're going to get the I first like first pick. Uh, Fred gets the sandwich picks. And because by uh, technicality, I uh, win the championship picks. So, uh, yeah, this week's draft is going to be our least favorite dance moves or dances of all time. All right. Let's go back in the, all right, in the back. Rolodex yeah, yeah, yeah. here. 1980s kid. Uh, but yeah, anyways, uh, we're going to start this one off with JP. What is your first pick for the worst dance or dance moves of all time? The Carlton. Oh, that's 
that's a fucking Come great. On. This, this no, is it. why no, he loses. This is why I lose. This is like, why I hate that one. I can do this one. I'm it's sure you can. Yeah, I, I, I mean, love this one. It's iconic when he does it, but when some jackass out at the fucking bar is that doing doesn't it, know what that, he's doing. Yeah, exactly. That's why I, put, I, I picked it. it all I, right, I get it. Just fucking light it. ease up off me, motherfuckers. I'm just saying. All right, uh, Fred, you get your first pick. There's so many. What do what do I start with? Okay, there's there's lots of them. there's lots of these. Um, let's just start with the sprinkler. Okay. Yeah. I I, I see. I don't like that one, but I also kind of like that one. Um, but yeah, fuck that guy. Uh, I'm gonna get uh my my least favorite one from the '90s is gonna be the Macarena. No, nah, it's a good one. Uh, that was the Damn it. dumbest yeah. fucking shit. Everybody knew it. That song came on. Everybody in the 90s got oh, yeah. so super excited. Yeah. And it's like the Hispanic line dance. Uh, you know, the cha-cha slide for Hispanics. Um, and let's see. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is that your next pick? <laughs> now we know. Huh? <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, uh, I, I am going to do one um, from uh, Polly Shore himself and uh, do the Funky Chicken. The Funky Chicken. The, the funky, funky Chicken. If you can name that movie <clears throat> from what that's from, I'll give you. Yep, a cock. And you know what it is? Uh, yeah. Uh, it's a tough one. Oh, it's a great fucking movie. It is movie. a great movie. Oh, can you, can you remember what it is? I, I'm, I'm pretty damn sure I know what it is. But. Okay. Uh, son-in-law. Yep. Very good. That is good it. job. God damn. Congratulations. I can't yeah. fuck with me. I can't. Shore. Yeah. I can't Great stop movie. Fred ever. All right, Fred, <laughs> you get your next dance move or dance. What do you got? I mean, I don't know what it's called, but I'm just going to call it the white dad. Uh, is that like you standing, standing there, in one place, kind of just moving kind of your swaying. fingers? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Maybe you pick your foot up to be funky uh, with it. Yeah. yeah. Should we do like? Is it? It's the pointer thingy. It's the white dad. The white dad. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we want this to get taken down, so we're gonna call this the white dad. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Uh, JP, you get two back to back, dog. Square dancing. Okay. Just all of just it. Just all square dancing. Wow. <laughs> all of it. Dude, chicks dig that though. No, no, they don't. I was a square dancer. Oh no? Yeah, but you were gay, square, right? <laughs> <laughs> is that what turned? Is that what turned yeah, the tide? What do you for think it? happened? <laughs> it's like I'm not getting any pussy with this. Let's no. go with some dick. Uh, all right, and your next pick and the uh, Cuban shuffle. Cuban shuffle. Cuban shuffle. Cupid. Shuffle. Cupid. Shuffle. Cupid. Okay, so it's, yeah. <laughs> it's like shit. Fucking I hate that, that fuck. Fucking oh, every time it. it comes on, I want to fucking just. I don't watch the DJ. Oh. I don't even know what that is. The I can just think of uh, is it the Cupid Shuffle? Yeah. To the right, to, to the, the right. right. That's what the it's the called. Yeah. Oh. Night, oh. Yeah, fuck Walk that guy. Back in for, uh, yeah, <laughs> okay. fucking and every yeah. fucking and stupid drunk bitch at the bar is up on the dance floor and it's thinking, fucking annoying. Thinking she knows the better yeah. version. Oh, of I it. hate them. I hate I'm that, that guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, Fred. Next pick. Um, let's just take it back to the YMCA. Damn it. That okay. was the one I was going to hope come <laughs> back. <laughs> you That's a little dance. personal for me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that feels like a hate crime. A <laughs> that, that is a hate crime. Oh, damn it. That was, that was the one I was going to take. Cause I was for sure that everybody was going to forget about it, but I'm wrong. Um, I'm going to go with, uh, the, the running man. Okay. That was a dumb one. And uh, oh, let's see. No, I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Uh, that one. I'm going to go with the trucker. Is that what it's called? The This one? Sure. Okay. Was, call it Jersey Shore. No, I was thinking more along the lines of uh, Starsky and Hutch. The big rig. That's what it's called. It's called the big rig. Oh, okay. It's the, this thing. Yep. And then he's like this. Yeah. Yep. So it's called the big rig. I'm going to go with that one. Because who the fuck looks good doing that shit? Starsky. And Hutch. H and Hutch. <clears throat> All right, uh, Fred, you get uh, one. <clears throat> just the one again? You just get one. Yeah, you're in I the middle, dog. this middle draft. I know, it sucks. I mean, I got two. I, th I think I'm going to take the... I think I'm going to take the worm. No! The worm. The worm. That's a good one. No! So worm, because nobody can fucking do it. I can do it! I fucking can I do, do the worm. We we We're going to take your word do for it. it. I'll do yeah. it. No, I'll take your word for I, it. I will definitely do the worm. Totally will. 
Next live show, I'll do the worm. You're too short to do the worm. Uh-uh. It's like a just caterpillar. Just yeah. long enough. Just long. <laughs> enough. It's more like a seesaw. It's the inch worm. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You do the inch I worm. do the inch worm. Yeah. Very good. JP, you get two in a row. It's your last two. The Roger Rabbit. Uh, do you know that one? You're too young. See, I that's do, why I never it's win. It's iconic, though. Uh, that's an iconic. Oh, it's a horrible man. thing. It's if a horrible I, thing. I didn't say it was good. Yeah. I just said it's I mean, iconic. it may be iconic, but it still sucks. I don't, I don't know what the Roger Rabbit... I know who Roger Rabbit is, I but... Can, I can't do it. I mean, I can... Kind of, yeah, just look... <laughs> no, it's not like that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't know. It was a good wow. shot. It was, was a good shot. Yeah. That was a great dance uh, move. Uh, <laughs> no, I just know Roger Rabbit. I don't know what the dance move is. And the... But anyways... Uh, Roger Rabbit and the Super Bowl Shuffle. Super Bowl. Ooh. <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> I had to throw that one in there because Derek's not here. That's correct. Yeah. Oh, man. For once, he probably won't vote for you. Well. Uh, is it the Super Bowl Shuffle or like the Bear Shuffle or something? It's some the shit? Super Bowl Shuffle. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll yeah, get did that, to you. I thought I didn't think I stuttered, but okay. I can say it again <laughs> if you'd like. If you really want me to. <laughs> <If you> really, <laughs> okay. Uh, Fred, this is your last pick. What do you got? There's so many that I want to go with. Yep. Um, I don't want to say them, so you don't take them. I know. But the worst dance move. Don't take mine. I was waiting on this. You were waiting on it? Yeah. Oh, well, it's not that one. Okay. It's not that one. But, Good. So I've got some honorable mentions. I well, don't, don't. No, you can't see it. I, know, I already saw it. I'm not going to take no, it. You, no, you have not seen it. Oh, oh, it's not that it, one. No, it's not. Oh, so it might be the one I want to take. Correct. So is it the dice shaker? No. Okay. Oh. Okay. okay. I'm going with that one. Yeah. <sighs> Thank fucking God. It's going to be something fucking stupid. No. You know it is. <laughs> no. Scotty's about to say it, so of course it's going to be stupid. Oh, damn it. I just thought of another one. Yeah, I did too. Son of a bitch. But it doesn't, t- it doesn't beat this one. This is the most annoying fucking dance on the face of the planet, and it starts with a fucking word. No, it's not. Gundam, Gundam style. <laughs> that stupid shit that all the kids were doing. Gundam style. Gundam style. Gundam. Fuck that shit. That's a great dance. That's a, no. That's a I'll great be, song. No. Yeah. It's awful. It's, it's fucking amazing. awful. I'll just it be drives hanging out. me I'll just be hanging nuts. out in my room smoking pot, and then the next thing I know, I'm up doing the Gangnam style. Oh, oh fuck yeah. that. It's so stupid. I, I was uh, Here's the other the other one I was kind of... Two I was stuck with. The, the Fortnite dance... That one, what everybody does, yeah. drives me fucking nuts. Which one's that? The floss. No, I like that one, bro. No, I yeah, don't like, I that, like that, one. that one. I was so I stupid. Like that one. Floss. I the, the Harlem That's Shake. Uh, I Harlem Shake's one. dope. I'll it take that. But the, but the kid that flossed, <laughs> it, I, like I the floss. punched that fucker in the face. I like the Fuck floss, that man. guy. <laughs> And then the, uh, I think there was, oh, there, there's one that I can't pick because when somebody does it and knows what the fuck they're doing is awesome. But if you don't know what you're doing, you look like a fucking idiot. And that is the moonwalk. You want to talk about iconic, you <laughs> dumb is. fuck. That's why I didn't pick it. <laughs> fuck that guy. Because fuck that I didn't guy. pick it. Yeah. I didn't pick it. But if you know what you're doing, you're giving me shit super. about the Carlton and then you go with the, the moonwalk. moonwalk. Fuck if, you. If you know what you're doing, it's great. But if you don't, you're an idiot. So that's that's where I'm at. What were you guys' honorable mentions? The Cotton Eyed Joe. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's a great one. That's a good one. Um, everybody line dances to Copperhead Road, and it's all different everywhere, but that's a Just good one. Line Just line dancing in general. Uh, yeah. No, no, fuck you. I should have picked line dancing. <laughs> yeah. no. Line dancing's fucking stupid. Line stupid. dancing is the easiest way to get pussy if you know how to do the dance. <laughs> From a fat bitch named Lizzo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Sure. Right. No, no bullshit. No, if you know how to dance no. a line dance, like watermelon crawl. And oh, my God. If the you know, watermelon crawl. Oh, yeah. If you know the basic version of Copperhead Road what's at a country other, bar, what's the other eighties hit? Yeah. Frickin' Achy Breaky Heart. Thank you. Yeah, that, <laughs> oh, the that had a line breakies. dance. It did have a line yeah, dance. Yeah, the Achy Breaky. We used, that's to, we used a, to own the VHS. Uh huh. How one. to do the Achy Breaky Heart? Nice. I forgot. Heel toe do si do. Come on, baby. Boot scooting. That was a good yeah. one. Boot scooting boogie. It, yeah, boot scooting boogie. If you could do those dances, yeah, there was good. always a hot country blonde that was like, he knows right. how to dance. I'm taking him home tonight okay. every fucking time. All so, right. Well, congratulations. So, anyways, yes, guys, you can go to our Twitter, which is at lot sidelines, and vote. 
Tips for your favorite list. How of about the robot? How didn't that make the list? I, that was on my list. It was on it, my list. Mine too, too but I didn't so, ever say it. Yeah, it wasn't. It just wasn't as good. As yeah. Some of I others. think. I, I think it's just. Yeah, it's not as shitty. Everybody does do it. It probably should have made the list. And we're gonna get a whole bunch of people like, oh, who the sure. fuck did you How not did pick? This not get there. It's not our list. Right. Yeah. That's all that matters. Yeah. Uh, but anyways, yeah, you can go and vote uh, on our Twitter at uh, which is at lot sidelines, and I'll put it also on Facebook. Hopefully, this one doesn't get fucking taken down. Which is at laughing on the sidelines. Vote for your favorite list of the shittiest dances of all time. Or just vote for me. <laughs> Please. <laughs> for let, the love of God. Just one. let me the win Carlton one. Carlton was his first pick. That's just negative all the way through. And then Derek's friends are all Super Bowl uh are Bears fans, so you're just not gonna get it. That's fine, man. That's true. I'm used to losing. Uh, but anyways, go and vote. We are sincerely to appreciate it. But now we get to get to my favorite part of every single episode. This is the laughing on the sidelines, shitty situation of the week all right ladies and gentlemen this is the laughing on the sidelines shitty situation brought to you by the new segment fuck that guy guy. any any new ones is there another one i gotta know one save them for next week Okay, fine. It's a new segment. You can't give them all away. Yeah, man. Yeah, don't give them yeah. everything at once. Well, you gotta they be don't that fucking guy. deserve it. Why do I got to be that guy? Yeah, don't okay. be that guy. Yeah, fuck me. <laughs> fuck that guy. Uh, absolutely. Uh, but no, this week is brought to you by BattleCornCarePackages.com. Uh, go check them out and, uh, you know, follow them on Twitter and all their socials. We sincerely appreciate them. Uh, but yes, this week's laughing on the sidelines shitty situation is is a rough one it's a rough one this is a bad situation no matter how you look at it which i guess is the kind of whole point for this yeah uh one way or another your asshole is probably gonna hurt uh this is would you rather do mr fister all by yourself or do sister fister with (laughs) With another person (laughs) a friend or what used to be a friend What used to be (laughs) yeah i mean (laughs) <laughs> I'm going sister fister all the way. You got to have video evidence yeah. to prove that you did it. Can I do both? <laughs> this, I'll, I choose both. This is the other th- problem with this whole situation is, is you're liking all of these. I'm in. <laughs> so, Not so you I keep, I keep one of each in my no, no box <laughs> <laughs> just in case. <laughs> is it this or is it? Oh, okay. This like, is the, the, the power fist. Oh. Yeah, the power fist. Oh. None of this. Oh, That's, no. It's not politically correct <laughs> yeah. anymore. No, it's definitely not. It's more like a that. That's that's what Mr. Fister... Li- yeah, it's like that. I, I, I've seen it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Italian. Mine's, mine's mama mia. Yeah, it's a mama, mama, mama mia. mia. Yeah, those Italian <laughs> okay. guys. So I'm going with both. You're going with both. Yep. Happily. Happily. Uh, I'm sure. <laughs> lube or no lube for you? <laughs> <laughs> easier it's just faster (laughs) it's less expensive jesus christ you asked i know i'm (laughs) silly i i'm that guy i'm that fucking guy that sets myself up no i see it it's just i i'm just that guy uh okay i I am not doing this with another individual at all. So you're going Mr. Fister. You're going Mr. all the way, huh? I, I, am, I am taking some anal ease, and uh, it, you just have to have a photo that it that it's there, and I'm... I'm <laughs> There's some anal ease. You know what also works? Cocaine. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> yeah. That sounds... <laughs> blow, a li- <laughs> blow a little on the old hole. That, that, you don't feel a thing. That, that, numbs, that, numbs it right up. That makes a lot more sense. I, I'll, I'll, I guess I'll do that. Uh <laughs> Yeah, I guess in the really shitty situation I have, I'm doing this by myself. So yeah, that's that's what I got. How about you, Fred? I, there's no way I'm going down alone. <laughs> no, no. There's no way I'm going. I down like alone. that. You're I like that. He's somebody. taking someone with you. Taking somebody with me. I like me, that. God, oh, so good deal. Oh my God. <laughs> Just because I'm not putting it up there it by ain't my no, damn self. It ain't no fun <laughs> if the homies can't that's have right. none. My fucking brother. Leave it. Leave You're it welcome. To, leave it. To, this is why he's the favorite brother. This is why he's yeah, the favorite. He's fucking I, cooler I, I, than I you are. People. Yeah, man. <laughs> you include everybody. He's very make, inclusive. Make everybody a part of the, yeah, the party. Come on you know? in. God damn it. So next up is the family fister. <laughs> <laughs> Five arms coming out of that <laughs> motherfucker. That's right. That's it's the caterpillar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. The centipede. Yeah, the centipede. Yeah, Jesus yeah. Christ. 
Uh, but guys, uh, do us a favor and uh, come out to watch Jeremy Joseph throw out the first pitch. Now, in the event that the rain does get the best of us and it does make us reschedule, uh, I know the people for the Wichita Wind Surge. They will make it right. Uh, I just know if any of you guys are, are driving down and wanting to see us, because we're all, I mean, other than JP, I believe a majority of us are going to be there. Uh, uh, yeah. I got to work, if, man. If you're a fan. Why are you of, fucking throwing me under the bus like that? If you're a JP fan, yeah. fuck that guy. He has to work. Um, yeah. But you Still show up and tell him that you like me the best. That'll exactly. really make their day. We're doing videos all day long. We might as well just make a fan video of right. all the people that like JP the best. That's dope. There's going to be a lot of people. I, I really hope so. So, but at least be there for all the people that don't know what the fuck's going on. It's going to be great. Um, but yeah, if you would like to come, just keep your eyes on the weather. Uh, we'll know probably a day uh, ahead of time of whether or not it's going to be rained out. So just keep your eyes peeled. Uh, but this is going to be a great time and an opportunity for those of you guys who are in the area that do go. You'll get to meet myself and whoever else is going to be there. Jay, I know Jeremy is going to be around for quite a while. Uh, unfortunately, Derek will be upstairs doing his fucking job. Uh, but majority of us comedians, uh, hopefully we'll all be able to make it. So, uh, tune in for that and, uh, we will see you out there Friday. Uh, I believe the gates open at five o'clock. So right on. first pitch normally happens about uh, 30 minutes before game time, which is seven Oh five. So be there right around six 15. Uh, but anyways, guys, right. that that is this week's episode. Thank you guys so, so very much. I really do appreciate JP. And as always, Fred, thank oh, yeah. you guys You're so very much uh, for helping me out. And guys, as we always like to say, do us a favor if you like us and tell your friends. But if you don't like us... We hope that you have to suck on the Dalai Lama's tongue after he <laughs> eats a bag of bagel bites. The whole bag. The, the whole, whole bag. bag. If you don't like us... Tell your enemies. And until next time, guys... Pizza in the morning, pizza in the evening, <laughs> pizza, pizza at supper time. time. When pizza's <laughs> on a bagel, you can eat pizza anytime. <laughs> Until next time. Keep laughing, assholes. We will see y'all later. Take care. <laughs>